What is up guys? It is October 20th. I'm going to start a series. I'm gonna go through every bait that I think is the best for fall bass fishing. It's starting to cool down temperatures here in Pennsylvania. Bass are starting to get weird and we're starting to have to figure them out. Today, we're using the square bill crankbait. This is one of my personal favorites for the fall especially. This bait is great. Uh, you can locate fish really easily with it. So we are going to uh, fish this pond behind me, maybe a few others tonight, and we are going to find fish with this crankbait. This is the one we are throwing today. We're gonna be throwing this and only this today, and then we're going to film another one coming up and go through the rest of the baits. But today, square bowl crankbait. Not a giant by all means, but that didn't take long. You can fan cast this thing. I can practically fish this whole pond and uh, locate those fish. That, I caught them when I was ripping it pretty well, and uh, that's the first time I did that, so I'm gonna try doing that more. It's going pretty good. Let's get more. One thing I could tell about that fish is it was really cold. That fish was really cold. That means the water temps are cold, and me slow rolling this thing and giving it some rips is gonna really work, because. Those fish are, that, that fish was deep. It's not like summer fishing when they're tucked up on the bank. That's one thing that I gotta pay attention to is that I'm casting out where uh, I know those pockets and deep spots are. So again, that fish was me ripping it. I mean, right when I hit the water, I ripped it down to the bottom. That fish ate it. Um, I mean, he smoked it. This is a little bit bigger one. They're still, you know, small. But uh, yeah, again, that fish, cold to the touch, um, and they're down there. You know, I have to get down to them. A square bill, it doesn't dive that deep, but in this, I can ri if I rip it right off the start, I can get it down there and uh, get those fish to so, uh, let them go. That's number two. Oh. Relatively the same size, maybe a tiny bit bigger than the last one. Uh, but man, I mean, it just goes to show how good this square bill is working. The red color is definitely helping. Red this time of year is amazing. Also in the spring. There we go, number three. Let's keep it going, right? I thought I could finesse it. I'm trying again. Oh yeah. Those were some good casts. I'm disappointed that I didn't catch one.
surf, surfing them on in, man. Nice. Really, not a lot better, but a little bit. They're, man, they're eating it right now. Hold on, let me let this guy go. The one thing I did notice about the square bill, and I have noticed, is the hook set ratio on at least the one I have and one with good hooks is it's better than any other bait. I mean, you guys have seen I maybe missed one fish and it was probably just a swipe. Other than that, bro, every every hook set I've had has been solid. It really is just a great bait. It's working amazing. I definitely recommend when we're coming into fall throwing this bait. Just throw the square bill, use it right, rip it, rip it down, get it, get it down there where the fish are. Then, then roll it slow. Give it some pauses, some twitches, play with it a little bit, and uh, you will catch fish. You will. And if you don't, you can come back and dislike the video. What the? So everything still works? My gosh, so violent. What's my rod? What the? Guys, when I tell you I'm out here catching hogs, I could go in the torn now. We can make them look big. You try to get the thumb out of the camera. That's what the square bill does. Magic. This is a joke. The knot that I just created. Got it. I just worked magic out here. If you guys need a rat's nest out, just uh, DM me. That's fine, I need more practice. I just wanna catch some fish. There we go. Right at the bank. Yup. Yup. Begging. Monster, man. Got him. Got, oh, that's a hefty one. That's a, that's a, that's a hefty one. Alright, that one got some weight to it. That's a pound. That's a pound. You know? Making moves. Money moves. The last one was like 0.2. Probably wouldn't even read on the scale. This one? Upgrade? About to let him go, but man, that square bill's putting in work. Work. Square bill's putting in work. Guys, um, I have no subscribers, by the way, so I don't even know who I'm saying. Guys, too, you know? There's no one. But if anyone ends up watching, I'm assuming you're gonna be from TikTok. If anyone ends up watching this video, follow my socials, okay? I'm just out here killing bass, left and right. Murdering them, you know? Right. But I talk to myself while I fish already. So like, for me to film it and post it, why not, you know? Because I already talk to myself. I just broke. I just lost my crankbait. I just lost my square bill on a fish. I'm gonna tie on this square bell now, or this whatever I'm gonna tie on. We're gonna tie it on now because I have like a tiny bit of motivation to do it, and I know when I get to the Nux Pond, I won't have any motivation to do it. I like this one, I think it's too deep diving. Oh, uh, I love that crankbait, man. I love that crankbait. I'm so mad, so angry. All right. Great big tight on. We'll see you at the other pond. Well guys, the camera died on us at the end there, but basically to sum up the day, the square bill worked well. It's a great bait for the fall and the spring. I recommend red, uh, but go get yourself one, man. Um, they absolutely kill this time of year, and I promise you we'll have success throwing that thing. So uh, go throw it. I hope you guys have a great night, great morning, great day. Whenever you guys are watching this. But um, stay tuned for more videos. I'm going to start posting way more. Um, but uh, thank you guys so much. Subscribe. Hit the like button if you like me.
and um, follow all the socials. So you guys take care and I'll try to do so myself. Peace boys.